All right. Welcome back to Ask Allison. Here is today's question. I'm launching my private practice and the niche I'm leaning strongly towards is burnout. Is that too broad of a niche? Thank you. So first I want to thank Therapy Notes for sponsoring Ask Allison. They are the number one rated electronic health record system available today with live telephone support seven days a week. It is clear why Therapy Notes has a 4.9 rating out of five stars and five stars rated on Google. Um, Therapy Notes makes billing, scheduling, note-taking, and telehealth incredibly easy. And now for all you prescribers out there, they are offering ePrescribe. If you're coming from another EHR, Therapy Notes makes the transition incredibly easy, importing the demographic data free of charge to get you going right away. Find out what more than 100,000 mental health professionals already know and try Therapy Notes for two months absolutely free. Go to therapynotes.com and then enter the promo code ABUNDANT at checkout. All right, so burnout can definitely count as a niche, but let's get more specific with your ideal client to make marketing easier and more effective. Almost everyone I know is burned out, but it looks really different for everyone. So describing your ideal client's experience helps them see what feels really specific and special and different for them. So for instance, um, we're going to talk about burning burnout differently for working moms with young kids that required their attention throughout the day during that first phase of the pandemic when everyone was stuck at home. If these moms haven't had a chance to come up for air since that time. They've been catching up, improving their dedication at work and all this extra parenting. That's one flavor of burnout. Um, and that's gonna sound really different from the critical care nurse that watched more patients die every day than they ever had to at work before while their uncle Jed insists that COVID was a hoax made by the government. And it's gonna be a different kind of burnout for a new grad who's had a hell of a time finding a stable job and feels like they missed out on important parts of their youth. Or a high school student busting ass in this competitive college admissions environment, and they may not have any resilience built up yet, so it can feel really crushing. And it's different for a CEO who's had the weight of their employees' well-being on their shoulders at a time when the economy is so unstable. When you speak specifically to which flavor of burnout your ideal client's experiencing, it anchors you as someone who really gets them, someone who can really help. So today's free worksheet this week is a part of the ideal client exercise that we have in the Abundance Party and the Know Your Niche course. It helps you get really clear on who you're serving. Each question has a purpose. It might seem vague to you right now without the whole course, but I think it can still be really helpful in how you conceptualize and think through how you market to this ideal client. If you need help with niche your ideal client work so that your marketing can be a thousand times easier, join us in the Abundance Party at AbundanceParty.com. If you have a question for Ask Allison, please DM me over on Instagram where I'm abundance underscore practice underscore building.